So this is how I compost. It may not work for you, but it works well for me. Uh, throughout the year, uh, I pile dirt and leaves and stuff from the garden. Um, I just pile it in this open compost pile. And uh, over time, uh, a matter of, I don't know, five months, six months, I have all this wonderful dirt below the leaves that I just kind of cut into and expose the dirt. And I uh, put it through my uh, homemade uh, sifter, if you will, or screen. I screen it all and I get these lovely piles of uh, dirt. I also put my uh, kitchen scraps and all that stuff in there, but I dig holes in a pile and I chop it up with the shovel as I'm digging the holes. Um, once I dump the compost in there, I chop it up with the shovel and then I bury it so I don't get uh, animals digging in it and I stick to, you know, vegetables and things that won't attract animals as much. And uh, like I said, I screen it and I get these nice piles of uh, soil that I spread across my yard and uh, nourish the grass and uh, provide a, um, a healthy uh, topsoil that retains water. So over the years, I've been watering less and less. And that's it. Like I said, it might not uh, work for everyone, but it works for me. It's my garden down there. Um, I have a separate pile just for the garden um, because I used um, herbicides um, at times in the in the yard, and I don't want that stuff mixing with my garden. Um, so I use that stuff to get rid of the weeds, um, and I don't like to mix that with uh, my garden. So whatever comes from the garden grass clippings what have you from the from the yard i put in here and stuff for the garden or from the garden i put over there and i have a nice little obvious boundary line between the two so i keep the hot side hot and the cold side cold and that's all i have uh also actually i screen by using a pointed shovel and I just go back and forth, back and forth, across the screen. Um, I made this screen, you know, with two by fours, put it on some legs. And basically, uh, what I want filters through, and what I don't want stays on top. And I can chuck it back into the pile to let it break down some more. If it's rocks or twigs, I chuck it somewhere else in my yard. And that's it.